Come on, new commentary. It's... Oh, sorry. Hey, Ryan. Damn. So yeah, it's LBA versus Davin right now. He probably likes it because it's uh, invincible side B against Snake's grenade pressure. He was actually kind of getting. I mean, he's, going, he's been going banjo all all today. I see. Because yeah, I mean, yeah, the last the last stream match against Davin, he was getting whomped. He had to switch to Yoshi after being out of two O deficit. Mm -hmm. uh, it's your boy Ryan back again with the news. They, okay. So Perry's the first of downer, but like lots of downers in this game has a landing hit box. So something you have to know about Dovin, just as a player, as a person, is that he's the kind of person you don't want to associate with the public. Like when I see Dovin in public, I just immediately just turn away because of how disgusted I am. Um, he takes pride in his snake, and honestly, I mean, look at this. He's just he's at 69.9, which is of course. Everybody. Meanwhile, you have people like LBA who are just gonna wander wing on the platform when your opponent is like nowhere close to you. Yeah. Um, so two degenerates. Definitely um, not sure <laughs> who's the more degenerate. The guy that blows himself up and wins neutral, or this one just... The, the other person who blows himself up and, and, and wins neutral yeah. with their own grenade? <laughs> it's disgusting. Okay, good read with the up smash. That's an interesting read. Uh, yeah, people are tempted to air dodge a little bit preemptively against that move, and it just goes straight up. It's pretty easy it, to it catch. Ling like it lingers at like yeah. the top of the arc. Very and well. Nice catching the startup on that move. Oh wow! You just, just up tilt. You can just up tilt and you would probably die. Okay, that works too. So, Dalman, he hasn't come out that much lately. Um, actually, no, recently started coming out. But before, he was actually quite absent sometimes. And the few times he didn't went, he would um, make modest placements like top nine, top thirteen, and sometimes he'd even uh, place a little bit lower. Just kind of surprising. But I've always known Dalvin as as much of a terrible person as he is. He definitely has the stuff to be top five in this school, and we're seeing it right now. Like, if you guys watch the stream setup that we had last week for TSS70 against LBA, I mean, LBA has been winning these free plays back to back, and he was he took him to a 2-0 deficit, and we're seeing really awesome snake play right now. I mean, we had the nice Z drop grenades, awesome use of C4. It's just so terrifying to be in this situation. Like, and it's super easy to lose track of C4 too. Meanwhile, we have LBA grabbing in the wrong direction and using forward smash yeah, on shield. I don't know why neutral. he's using this character. I mean, technically it's even, but <coughs> what he said earlier is that um, he le he played banjo like a long time ago. He wanted to see if he still vibed with him, and he likes it because it's a heavy. Nice and SD oh. coming from Davin, uh, making sure that these stocks are uh, definitely not in his favor. Um, like that, good show of sportsmanship. Now, okay, so I mean, the down air was basically an SD from LBA, so you know. What? Did he die from down here before? Up tilt. No. I mean, like. No. What are you doing? Okay, that works. But still, we're down to perfectly even. Even though, by all rights, neither of these players should be winning. It should just be like both losing. <laughs> yeah. Um. We should just DQ both of them, honestly. I mean, uh, audience, is this fun to watch? Do you like watching a man blow himself up and just, just blow the opponent up slightly more than himself and then win neutral? God, they even is this the, what you They enjoy? even have the same dash attack. Yeah, okay, he's using these Wonder Wings in such unsafe positions. Like, it's very obvious that he's not very close or even in the path. Then he's just Wonder Wing, maybe anticipation of the grenade in the C4. But Dobbin's just waiting in shield, and he's... Okay, that was a very odd Nikita. Not a move you often see in neutral, but... It's not a move that you often see in neutral in the middle of the stage. But Dobbin still does it. Not like that, of course. But he'll actually, after putting up a wall of two grenades in a C4, he'll jump down and then Nikita to... I, I believe it's to catch their bad air dodges when they're faced with the grenades. I'm amazed he's not going... Is there, I'm, I'm not sure if there's maybe too much startup for the up tilt out of dash. However, there have been times where he's really close to that ending lag of... Of um of wondering and he definitely had the time to pull that out. He's dead. No. Get air dodge upward. Woo! He's trying to get the confirm. The drop down, I believe, uh, hit one in there. Yeah, he's dead. Yep. And this time. Hey! Oh my God! Thank you. It's maybe like maybe we might have been saving it for when it counts. Maybe he knows the percents. I mean, when it counts in this matchup is just not good. And if you if you have, if you have the opportunity to kill them, then you kill them. Yeah. No, so. But Maybe he maybe he knows something we don't about like uh, maybe Dalvin is a prick and that's why no one likes him. That's the conclusion that I've established here. So um, if they don't go to great offensive non Omega, then these are both um, these are both fraudulent players. Mm -hmm. And we're seeing the contemplation. He's tempted. 
He, that I mean, we did, we did see a set earlier on the King of Fighters stage. I see. So, I know, like, it's very... That's a step in the right direction. Oh! Oh, we're getting close? Oh, no. Smashville. Mm -hmm. What a boring stage. Thank God us commentators can't hear the music, so we don't have to, you know, have Smash 4 flashbacks. Yeah, Smash 4. That's Smashville in general. And he's going to Banjo again. This is not a good idea if he actually wants to win this tournament. Um, being sent to the losers right now is a bit dicey. There's a lot of good people down there. And he he might Banjo think it's best of three, but then it's not until winner's semis, no, it is, right? Is, uh, is this quarters? This is quarters. Oh, no, no, no. This is, yeah, this is best of three. He knows it. Like, okay. we, we all know it. So he's just doing a very risky pick. This might bite him in the ass. I think I think he believes in the banjo. It was like, it was last talk last He might last believe time. in the banjo, but honestly, sorry, Ludwig, I don't. Um, your Wonder Rings are way too unsafe. This is kind of, well, if he stops doing that, then he'll stop taking a majority of damage and kills. He blew himself on his own grenade too. <laughs> is this surprising? It's Snake. <laughs> no, no, I was talking about Banjo. Oh, Banjo. Okay, he threw out his grenade and then he ran halfway across he's, the stage. He's trying to, he's trying to emulate the snake gameplay right now. It's just like a cancer. It's spreading. That, okay, wow, like, that if you forward smash that. was an amazing read if it hit. Um, I think it was just amazing, but not in a good way. Wow, getting hit right in the grenade. Um, well, yeah, nice perfectly the into the only place where he get hit by that grenade. That just he's like specific. I think he specifically walked just to get that shimmy. All right, so um, down smash at ledge after up smash is pretty popular amongst. Oh, okay, and we'll hit the down smash. Ro the roll on down smash. All right, I'll be taking the first stock this time. How things change? It's almost like when you don't wonder wing over and over again in neutral, really unsafe positions. You don't die as early. All right, so what are we gonna see here? Uh, Fully charged up smash. And this time, I'm gonna wondering okay, right back so on the now stage. he's not doing. Um, <laughs> now he's not being patient enough like he was last game when he was just singing shield. Great awareness. You know, as hard as it is for the opponent to keep track of C4, I feel like the Snake main also has to definitely be putting a lot of um, mental investment into C4 positioning. I mean, yeah, oh my God, disgusting there. Like, people dying from disgusting their own there. Yeah. Did you see that? That was like 23%. Mm -hmm. That was a, such a meaty move. He has two crazy moves out of shield. He has Nair out of shield and he has down, um, down air out of shield. Davin needs to just... St like, I, like, like, obviously the up smash is just like this like, ledge trap of choice. But I think he needs to like adapt to what LBA is doing here, or, or like at least, at least time it. Oh yeah, like time it or bait it. Honestly, to it's not too bad of a trade if he gets hit with the uh, with a very far portion of um, a Wonder Wing. Obviously, he doesn't want to get hit in the first place. But if he can expend those five, then uh, you're looking at a character that needs an invincible side B against a zoner like Snake without side B. Uh, that was oh second and last nice one. Carry oh, so close. He would have gotten that. He didn't have to shield. So he has the right idea. It's Okay, he's dead. Yeah, I, he did, it's so predictable, and he's never going low. Yeah, and and you know, I just, that's why I didn't have, I didn't believe in it. I mean, he might win this one for sure. It's not exactly over yet, being at ninety-one percent. But I mean, if he keeps doing that, <laughs> there's one. So he's on his last stock with um, four with Dobbin wings. being on his on a second stock. He doesn't have the he doesn't have the luxury to be wasting Wonder Wings like this, especially when Snake is such a great dealer and of damage. And he just took 30% from that one yeah, Nair. Yeah, that, that Nair is disgusting. And look at this. this is he tried, he, he was charging up Smash, but he just crap. did not have the awareness. Yeah, if he gets hit by his own projectiles, he's just, these trades are amazing. And um, of course, like people say, you know, there's no such thing as a bad trade if you're ahead of stock. Is this true? No. Oh, no, that is not. Um, I, I thought I thought he might have that. like a tilt or something. That's he true. should have run know. up and then up smash or up tilted. I think either of those moves would kill right there. But we're seeing, yeah, he's he's dead. an entire stock down. Oh, no. What flubs? An, a, or or a maybe oh, or maybe down. Davin wanted to try and disrespect, but he's like, nah, I'll, uh, I'll just good up games. Tilt um, the very sketchy pick coming from uh, LBA. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't want to crap on his banjo too much, but it's very obvious the skill gap between. That character and his other characters is wide enough to notice. Was that semis? A semis. Oh, so it is semis. Oh, so, it is okay. Semis. So he was just so he's doing what he did last time, where he sandbags the first two games. No, and then he didn't. The thing is, he played. Um, did he play? Carol? He played Carol the first time, but he played uh, <laughs> Mario the second time, and his Mario also got kind of whomped. Oh, okay. Yeah, like he, Dobbin is not bad. He just sometimes has weird placings. That's what prevented him from being out of the top ten. But he is top ten contenders, and with his recent placing as third. At TSS 70, I mean, I have no doubt that he's going to be moving up in the ranks quite fast. Now, he's pulling up the Yoshi, which worked last time. But he's essentially put himself in a pit of two-game deficit. And now he has to win three games in a row. And against Dovin Snake, that's not easy. Mm -hmm. All right, so, we're, so basically, I think the Yoshi pick is actually decent for this matchup. Um, I don't think Yoshi wins. However, it's probably much more even 
than and actually I wanna say Banjo, because Banjo used well could definitely screw this character with his reliance on Bernal's and whatnot. <laughs> but definitely better pick overall because not only is he much more familiar with Yoshi, but Yoshi has this godlike aerial mobility. Like this dude can literally almost cover like three quarters of the stage with one jump. Like, a and LB I think like has like a very like not over like it's not like a Tifa level of aggressiveness, but then like his play is generally like put pressure on you and like try to like suss out bad defensive options. It's a, it's and Yoshi good. helps a lot with that. Okay, yeah, good recovery. It's uh, his Yoshi is a good anti zoner. Um, against my Richter, I think maybe on a stream set a long time ago, he switched to Yoshi in one when Mario and Luigi didn't work out very well. Mm -hmm. And the reason why his Yoshi is such a good anti zoner, I think Yoshi's in general just their attributes have what it takes to be a good anti zoner. First of all, that aerial jet is great for closing distance. Which is what you want to do. You want to close distance. You don't want to let Snake put out this wall of two grenades, a Nikita, up smash, C4, what have you. Um, like we're seeing happening right now. But this percent slowly but surely building up. It almost up. feels like LBA is like, I don't know if this intent. Like, look, he's almost like zoning damage himself. He's like, I'm going to throw eggs. Like, that's what are you the thing. Do? He, th that's the second portion. He has a great option. Oh, God. Yet. And that Nair to forward air. Full stock ahead. Uh, reading the defensive option right there, or lack of, I'm not sure if there was an air dodge right there. I think that there was one, he just waited it out and prepared. But those eggs are really great at, at just forcing um, laggy grenade pulls and what the fuck was that? Oh um, laggy gosh. grenade pulls and stuff like that. It'll punish it from three, three quarters of stage C4 recovery here. You can do it. He's nope. Why didn't he not air dodge up for yet? Did he have it? Did you lose his air dodge already? I don't know. Okay, so we said two stock from Yoshi. Um, Likely to put a dent in his rhythm, but he still is up 2 1. This is still a tournament life for LBA, and that's a great position to be in. Um, but yeah, Yoshi just great aerial drift, covering that distance fast in the air, which is also nice because he does not have to approach grounded. And approaching grounded forces you to stay in shield, which Snake can exploit with, um, with good grabs and whatnot. Also, just the grenades falling on the ground are kind of scary, as well as C4. When one needs in the air high enough, he just avoids all of that. Unless um, the grenades the only are held. The only thing you can do is like run back dash attack, which like if you like if you pr if you like pressure space first, they don't they won't like have like a reasonable space to like run back dash attack. Um, exactly. Yeah. Or and up tilt and like up tilt, you can kind of just mitigate by like. I mean, not up tilt. Being... Oh, Davin's going wolf. wolf. Interesting. Now Davin does have a wolf. Um, the thing is, he has kind of pick advantage here because. Um, I'm not. He has played against um, LBA with Wolf, I believe, against his Mario, and I'm not sure he did very well. But against Yoshi, this could be a different story. Um, Wolf, not nearly as reliant on projectiles, although that neutral B is disgusting in terms of percent and uh, priority. You're also looking at a character that's just oh, just kill power is disgusting, and um, his anti aerials are really great. That was dumb. His anti aerials are really great. But, I mean, like, and, and LBA's Yoshi is very aerial. It has great aerial drifts, he's going off stage a lot. So, Wolf definitely can exploit that, but you don't, you can't exploit it if you jump off the stage, um, fast fall, and then kill yourself. Also, like, Davin is just pressing buttons, and LBA is like, okay, I will trade. I, yeah. I'll just, like, press my what buttons. One of these too. up to, like, the cusp of ledge. He's putting himself in perfect territory, like. I think he might just be pressing up B on instinct, and then realizing, like, oh crap, my up B just does not do that. Yeah, no, um, no, uh, whatever, Cypher. I mean, yeah. Ooh, nice jab block. Ooh! Spicy. Wants to be on that, uh, highlights number three right there. Um, oh, <laughs> armoring right through the egg. I guess thanking with it. But that was armoring because the hitbox is still out. I did not know that would do that. that Maybe was, the egg does not have I do not know what... Yeah, that, that was a weird upbeat, just like in the middle of the stage. Okay, so he should have recognized that Yoshi having his area mobility was way out of percent to down throw um, dash attack. And LBA could have punished that real hard. Now he's alive. Okay. The double roll is was getting punished. Like, wow, okay. Uh, Davin is the luckiest man alive. Yeah, LBA rolling into a waiting Yoshi now starting to DI. DI can probably straight in, that off the top. I think he's wrapped to DI out a little bit. But um, I'm not seeing a lot of not seeing a lot of drop down fares, which is usually something you see Wolf do a lot. He's drop down fairing and he wants to get that fair into fair. And I don't see the grab to up air a lot. We're getting this damage, but oh, it's just so not worth the trades that he's taking. He's taking. He's at 68 percent. And one well, like, more percent. Like, like we saw like when he was uh, baiting with um, like he would like double jump in, double jump out, and then punish LBA. Like that's that's when he was like doing well. But then now he's just. 
Like you see, he's just kind of like pressing buttons, spot dodge, pressing buttons. Spot Why dodge. are you up being straight to your your up is not good enough to cover that? Oh my god! Ooh, nice catch with the nair. Never mind. Just enough. He's dead. Oh, he has a jump. That's dead. Did he lose his jump? How did he lose his jump? Um, I thought he didn't have a jump. I mean, I thought he did have a jump. No, he jumped from ledge, mm -hmm. and, and then, then the caught. nair hit him back into stage, mm -hmm. and then he didn't have a jump, and he was probably trying to spam it. So, um, so I better see this. Quickly makes the set even. Yeah, this is uh, I mean that wolf was just that was a dumb pick. Yeah, I think like uh, trying to just play the snake and adapt yeah. rather than switching to another matchup might have been the call. I don't want to call out Davin's uh, wolf too much, but I mean I don't want to call out Davin's wolf, but I'm gonna call out Davin's wolf. Yeah. Here's how I'm gonna call out no, Davin's I, I, wolf. I'm gonna force Yuppies myself suck. to do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know my man Caillou putting on the heat right now. I'm sure Davin is feeling it over there, which is why he's so trepidation. Like, like this trepidation level is rising quickly. Okay, back to snake. How it should have been the past two games. And if he just kind of, if he just respected Egg more, and respect that aerial drift, I think a lot of things Yoshi's are punishable out of shield uh, with down air or nair. Um, the only thing that you have to watch out for is that Yoshi nair out of shield. But um, yeah, please, please do so if we if we can afford it. If we can afford it. Also, like respecting uh, Yoshi's space, and then like let's say like using forward tilt or something. I feel like yeah, or just like like because I feel or, like uh, use spirits and then have a powerful C C four something like that. That's always an option. Yeah, I feel like like Davin, like, like it this. works, but like it or like it works sometimes. But like, he's just doing like very similar things where it's like I am going to just set up my projectiles and then Terrible apparently eat three, yeah, apparently eat three Yoshi, down tilts in a row. Yeah, to, to down tilt him three times in a row. Not only that, but snake off stage is not good. The uh, cipher is so slow and predictable, and the the only option you have out of that is air dodge. And air dodge is not foolproof. There are definitely a decent amount of vulnerable frames after your air dodge towards ledge, and if. If LBA is cognizant of that, he can just wait and then nair right when um, he's close to ledge after the air dodges, and that'll probably kill him at this percent. Nice edge cancel with the back air to be able to like, right. get out right Down throw to punish. up tilt. Uh, yeah, okay, well that will also definitely kill. Are we going to see... I will call it an upset. It, it is kind of an upset. This is former number 2 PR right here, LBA. But, um, I mean, Dobbin is, like I said, Dobbin's top 5 material himself. Great DI, making sure not to... Yeah, too close to this. That was up. an insane sequence for LBA, and the fact that none of it killed is Ooh. even crazier. Oh, the okay. forward air just all no the way options. down. Yeah, ugh. I think he just twenty percent like, has nothing. Yeah, I think he just didn't expect him to go for it, but you should always expect LBA to go for it. Oh, uh, I think that he had a true grab out of there maybe or something. I'm not sure if anything's super true. Oh, he's, yeah, he's doing the grab out there. Ooh, Dobbin nice. is so good at doing that. He's great at just. <laughs> And using the grab C4s. armor to like uh, have invincibility yeah. from the LBA projectiles. needs to be more uh, cognizant of this. He needs to recognize that these C fours are just destroying him right now. And that so was like we're seeing like Davin like going in like 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 you oh, see his dash no, back, he's doing no, forward tilt, a little bit grab. That would have been like cool. before Davin was just like ah I need to like I need to run away and do grenades, but now he's like okay I will oh, actually Jesus. get into your space and LBA is, is like what, is what do you mean? Okay good that was terrible DI as well. Um, I believe the DI was out and down. But, yeah, I mean, that was clearly uh, to the right and up angle, and I think he died all the way in. But we are seeing a stock deficit from LBA's side, and this is great. I the think that's the first time he's been a stock deficit from when, since he picked Yoshi. Yeah, I believe it has as well. Oh, great DI. Holy. What God. was that, Nikita? I think that's supposed to be a B reverse. He might die from this. A grenade. No, um, air dodge towards ledge, <laughs> saving him a bit. He's going to die here. Oh, oh no, the Cypher barely hit. Air dodge, perfect Cypher. Oh, great damage. Um, oh, just barely gets um, caught by the back air. I wonder if that was the Iron Block. That looked pretty fast. He was at 170%. Yeah. Um, uh, but like, so have, like uh, a that was an even game. game, yeah. And, um, well, let's see. I'll be evening it right back up. Now, this is going to be set under the wire, I feel like. I feel like this is not going to be uh, quickly uh, resolved. I mean, I, I think if Davin just kind of like tries to camp ledge. It might be because that's what got him. That's what screwed him in the first place. Where like, yeah. LBA has so many like different oh, no. ways to like deal with damage. Jesus off Christ! What a risky C4 that paid off. Look at this damage. Uh, this is uh, this is definitely we're getting into up to the Catches the nair. Oh, the Nikita. Nikita? Kill. Oh wow! I'm he does that. <gasps> he oh! does that. His jump. And right. Davin takes it three Davin two takes over, it three LBA. over LBA. Yeah. Um, I, I said those probably those characters coming back to bite him in the ass. But still, that is not um, that is not like conceding this at all. That's not uh, jeopardizing, or not jeopardizing, but that's not um, compromising this win. This was a great 3-2 set.
and Davin taking it over yeah, and it's not number like two it, ranked. Yeah, and it's not like.